Why do we celebrate the anniversary of an assassination? Fifteen years ago, in the middle of a plague that nearly destroyed Dunwall, a paid killer assaulted the palace where I was born and stabbed my mother in the heart. In the aftermath, the men who sent the assassin tried to use me as a pawn in a game of power. They would have succeeded, but my father, Corvo Atano, hunted them down and cut their conspiracy to pieces. All these years later, am I the ruler my mother wanted me to be? Now, we face a new crisis. A monster the papers are calling the Crown Killer has been picking off my enemies and dressing it up like my father and I are responsible. I don't know whether to get on a ship and sail to the opposite side of the world, or to have everyone around me executed. Watch your step, Majesty. I'm not looking forward to all the ceremony today. Your signet ring. There. You're ready. Thank you, Alexei. Open the doors. All hail Her Imperial Majesty, Emily Caldwin. Loyal subjects, we're going through a difficult time, but today we honor my mother, the late Jessamine Caldwin. May her memory survive through the ages. Emily. You look tired, Father. Every year, I think the anniversary of Jessamine's death will be easier, but it never is. I wish Mother was still the Empress. I don't think I'm very good at this. You're still learning. Don't worry about the rabble-rousers and we'll catch the Crown Killer, eventually. People are saying it's you, that these assassinations are a misguided effort to protect me. No, someone's trying to make us look guilty by targeting your enemies. I wish I could just run away from all this. Sometimes you do. You think I don't know about your nights out on the rooftops? Courage, the ceremony will be over soon. Royal protector and father. I should have passed a law against that combination of titles years ago. Your Majesty, before we begin the day's observances, we have an unexpected visitor. The Duke of Serkonos. Ramsay says the Duke is bringing special gifts. That's intriguing. Duke of Serkonos! Mechanical soldiers? Amazing. What is this, Ramsey? I didn't authorize those things. Your Imperial Majesty and Royal Protector Corvo Atano, a native of our homeland, Serkonos offers condolences on this sorrowful day and gifts to remind you of our nation the rising star on the southern horizon. We thank you, Your Grace. Save your thanks, for now I give you the greatest gift of all, family. I present the lost sister of Jessamine Caldwin, your rightful empress, Delilah Caldwin. Impossible. My mother had a sister? My dearest niece, hello. It's not true. My father was Emperor Yuhorn Jacob Caldwin, and Jessamine was my younger sister. At the time of her death, I wasn't ready to make myself known to you, and I was forced to leave Dunwall. But now I'm home. If you really are my mother's sister, you're welcome to stay as long as you like. Little Sparrow, blackened by bad memories, I'm here to relieve you of your crown. My father's promise, whispered in secret so many years ago, is now fulfilled. Watch your tongue. Emily Caldwin is the daughter of Empress Jessamine Caldwin. Royal Protector, how naive to think you could get away with these murders. Living in my palace has protected you, but that's over. Hear me, all of you. 
Your rightful Empress has returned. All hail the Empress Delilah. First of her name. Arrest Emily Caldwin and her father for the Crown Killer murder. What? Lock him in the Empress's chambers, and then I'll bring him to Coldridge Prison <laughs> until his trial. My father lost it all. Sent me to the city watch, one step above begging. Think I had to take your orders? Corvo Itano, son of a Zirconan tradesman. Captain Ramsey, I heard shouting. Lord Corvo, what happened? Ah! That'll be all, Captain Mayhew. Fancy weapon. What kind of sword folds in half? There's a legend in the city watch the Empress's last resort, the safe room inside your daughter's chambers, is holding enough gold to buy an island. And they say this is one of the only two keys. What? What happened? Alexei, the throne room, Emily. Nothing I can do alone. I need to get out of here. Sir, how long is it going to take, Captain? starts another chapter, but will it get as bad as those times? Maybe I should just spin it, pick a place to lick my wounds. I've got to regroup. has a way of turning sour just as soon as you get comfortable. Delilah took away the mark of the outsider. No more sword. Protector. Uh, is Lady Emily There's all right? There's a coup underway. Emily is... she's imprisoned for lack of a better word. You've got to get out of the tower. Maybe through Emily's safe room. There was a captain earlier today down at the docks looking for you. Get away! And help Emily. I'm sorry, Captain Mayhew. Goodbye. The 
these bastards are working with Ramsay and the Duke of Circonos. off we should have the time we need just stay here and stall anyone who comes by i'll be back when i've searched the royal chambers assuming i don't accidentally lock myself in this damn safe room we'll cover for you if anyone from the duke's party returns huh, this is exciting everything's changing <laughs> yes the natural order is reasserting itself the ramses once hosted the king and queen of morley did you know that I spent my childhood playing with the buntings and the boils and the cream of society. And very soon you'll be back at the top, Captain. Ramsey's family fell from the aristocracy and apparently the man holds a grudge. How it's anyone else's fault, that's beyond me. But one way or another, Ramsey is too dangerous to be left in play. Stop me from bringing you home, Emily. made this lock. Emily would fall asleep in here after the plague. I suspect the Crown Killer is connected to Delilah's coup. Out into the world once more. How many people had forgotten this mask? Beechworth made this. Wonder what advice he would have about today. The reserves won't help against Delilah, even if I had a way to carry it all out of here. I'd better take these. <laughs> <laughs> 